have some snow popping up in the northeast now, all the way into the Canadian Maritimes, all the way down through New York and even uh, Pennsylvania, picking up some snow and that colder air. For us, and this is tied, the same weather system, we have that front that is rolling through our area and still some rain in behind the front that works in uh, during the uh, morning and early afternoon. Temperatures are in the high 60s and 70, I see now, in uh, Boynton Beach. Look at all the fog on the lens here. Uh, this is West Palm looking north. Tough to see, well, you can't even see uh, Singer Island off in the distance this morning. That fog will lift. Uh, showers are working in, though. A band of rain working through the Treasure Coast through the mid and late morning, right over Port St. Lucie into Stewart and Palm City. It falls apart, almost falls apart as it moves into Palm Beach County late morning. Uh, Keep in mind, you may run into some wet weather this morning, early afternoon. No risk for severe weather. Looks good for the uh, Dolphins win this evening. 72 uh, for temperature if you're headed down to tailgate. And we have that front rolling south. We have another front on the way. El Nino winter. And this one pushes through on Wednesday, but ahead of the front, a line of showers and storms. It'll work in Tuesday evening. And the Storm Prediction Center is placing us in a marginal to slight risk for severe weather. So an isolated severe storm is possible. on two, Right now, it looks to be Tuesday evening from roughly 7 p.m. through midnight. Small craft caution for boaters. Uh, not for the nearshore waters, it's not bad. I just showed you Fort Pierce. I mean, it's very, very smooth. Uh, moderate chop for the inland waters. And uh, as you get offshore, it gets choppy pretty quickly. So showers, fog, clouds. You see the little sunshine there? Blink and you miss it. There's not, this is not a beach day. And 62 tonight with a little bit of clearing, but Again, not much, and that means tomorrow, limited sunshine, isolated shower, 75 for tomorrow's daytime high. Here's your exclusive seven-day forecast with Tuesday evening looking at some showers and storms. Very warm and humid Tuesday, cooling off again Wednesday and Thursday. Another front comes in, a late weekend, so that means Friday and Saturday, showers and storms in the afternoon and then cooler again on Sunday, especially later in the day. So it is a roller coaster ride. This is typical El Nino winter for South Florida. Back after the break.